In this video, I'm going to visit a World War II bunker. It was built in the early 1900s for port defence and anti-aircraft defence, and I have no clue what any of that is, but now you know. If you want to know more about it, then search up Fort Crosby on the internet. I don't want to do a 10 minute intro, so let's get going. Well, I've climbed up here and I think it's meant to be somewhere around here according to Google Earth. I don't see it yet though, so I'm just going to keep looking. It should be around here though. This is definitely the wrong place. There's no bunker here. I think I'm lost. I wonder if I could climb this. This is so steep. I don't know how I just stole my butt I did. Um, yeah, I'm not seeing it, all I'm seeing is a view. Yeah, I'm very much confused. Look at that, that looks really nice. Right, so this isn't a bunker, but it's a scary building. I think it's used for water treatment and it's been infected with feces. Why is the roof like blocked off like that? Probably to stop teenagers getting in, like myself. This place is definitely haunted. I wonder why it's locked off. What's this event? Don't know what that is. Open up, open up. Oh, wastewater pumping station, that's what it is. I don't even know what that is. But locked. Ugh, oh, this cobwebs, ugh. Locked anyway. Right, so as you can see, there's loads of rocks here, and apparently there used to be houses here, and they got destroyed by so and so. That's why there were loads of rocks here, and it actually looks kind of cool. For a bit of history, all of the rocks and debris on the beach are apparently from buildings bombed during World War II from surrounding areas, and they were apparently all just dumped at that part of the beach for some reason. I'm not 100% sure that this is true, but this is what I read online. I've seen it from various sources, so it probably is true, but you can do a bit more searching up online if you want. So search up rocks at Crosby Beach, and you'll probably find some information on it. I think that's it over there, actually. Well, I'm gonna go over there and see if that's what I think it is. Alright, so I think this is one part of it, and the other part of it. I'm not seeing any clear entrance inside here. Yeah, it's all sealed off, so let me try over there then. Right, so there's a hole there, you can kind of see the inside. I'll bright it off when I'm editing this so you can see it easier, or like I'm ready to see it's black. But there's an actual entrance in the thing. Oh god, I did it, it just fell over. But there's an actual entrance there. I'm not going to go properly inside because just look at it below. Like, I'm going to stand in this little area here. So. Right, so there's actually a third part to it as well, over here. And this one actually has a much easier entrance. Not that, obviously, this is some holes, so you can kind of see the inside of it. I think there's a lot of spider there, it's horrible. Um, there's some fallen over stones here. There's another little gap there, that's that's actually quite a long fall. Typical England graffiti. What I've got in here, right there. Oh, this is creepy, it's all there's so much graffiti down here. Is that a Mona Lisa? There's a hallway there. There's loads of litter and stuff. More graffiti. This is creepy as hell. Right, so there's also a fourth part apparently. 
So here it is. Is um, that's blocked off. But then if I jump down here, there's another little gap there. I can't really climb in there. I think that's like a window. You know, that's like some sort of window with a spider web. Okay, let me try to show you the inside of this. These are like really abandoned and they've been infested by a lot of chaps with graffiti and stuff. There's another fifth bit here. There's not much to this one. But there's also another gap there. I didn't even notice that before, but there's also another entrance there. There doesn't seem to be much in that room. Right, so there's another entrance here which I just saw through the window. I'm gonna try to show you this. This place is full of spikes, it's really dangerous. That's all the footage I recorded and I never did an outro, so thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.